uh, course now, I'm learning there about body parts. The thing is body parts, and then, then they do themselves. Then I continue with my activities again. Okay. Mm -hmm. So at 11:30, uh, it's resting time. So they have now resting time. Yeah. We want one to more. Bye -bye. Oh, bye, nice to get along. Thank you very much. We can sing that. Bye -bye. Thank you. Making sure that the next generation is really coming up. Thank you very much. Um, first of all, happy International Day of Education. Today is the International Day of Education. And I think this is a perfect day to come to visit your center. Um, I arrived in Namibia this morning, and this is my first visit to your beautiful country. I have to admit that I have been looking forward to this visit for a long time, as a Finn also. Uh, I had an honor to meet also your Deputy Prime Minister and Foreign Minister this morning. So actually that was uh, the first part of my program. And we were discussing on tangible results, you know, how for the Europeans, the taxpayers and Europe, whose money we are actually using uh, in different projects in, in, in different partner countries, including in Namibia, for them it's important to see that, okay, how their money is used, that it's used in a wisely and, and, and accountable way. But also for, for our partners in, in Namibia and other uh, regions, uh, it's important to see that, okay, these projects really provide a tangible result. And I think from this perspective, it was very, very interesting to come to visit this center, see these buildings, the beautiful colors. This was the first thing I noticed that, yes, colors, I love this. It's not, you know, only gray and white and black, but, you know, uh, green and, and, and blue, very clear colors. But, of course, also meet the children. Because they are the future of Namibia. They are the future governors, the future ministers, whoever knows, maybe also commissioners. And how we are able to provide opportunities for these children, but in general children in Namibia and elsewhere, it is through the education. And that's why we need to invest in education. That's why we have been supporting Namibia for 15 years relating to early childhood education and, and education in general, because we see that you are the country who wants to invest in education, you, who want to invest also your uh, children, and we want to be an important partner in that endeavor. Um, to today, actually later today, I'm going to sign a new budget support contract. Uh, amount is 16 million euros. So we definitely will continue our support. So this is not the end. Uh, I would say uh, this is this is the beginning, in a way. Um, so through this budget support program worth 16 million euros, uh, we want to construct more classrooms, of course, uh, and also support on school feeding. So let's see. Hopefully, in the future, we are also able to provide school meals here, and. What is the most important thing is also to invest in teacher training. Because as a former teacher myself, uh, it's good to have nice classrooms, it's good to have nice buildings. But, I mean, without teachers, they are just buildings. Yes. And that's why the role of the teacher training is so important. I'm happy to uh, learn that uh, ministry is providing this seven weeks course, but frankly speaking, it's too short. It's you need to do more. Mm -hmm. Because if you want to be a well qualified teacher, even though I see a very talented people working here, uh, you need to train them more. And I hope that we could support you 
to be able to organize uh, more training uh, to your teachers, uh, increase the quality, but also, of course, uh, educate and train <coughs> more teachers, because I also understood from the minister that you are still lacking of teachers, so that you need more teachers also in, in Namibia. And for that, I'm happy to announce that uh, on Thursday this week, I'm going to launch uh, our regional teacher initiative. So it's uh, purely for Sub-Saharan Africa, uh, worth of 100 million euros. Uh, and the idea is precisely to support Sub-Saharan African countries to train more teachers, but also focus on the quality of the training. And I, 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 uh, <laughs> I sincerely hope that also Namibia could benefit of this uh, initiative. I also mentioned that to your Deputy Minister and Foreign Minister. And uh, my team here, uh, my excellent team, is, is also ready to uh, give you and provide uh, more information in details in that initiative. Because um, we really see that, uh, especially in Africa, we need to train more teachers, but also focus on, on, on the quality. But the same thing is and challenges, of course, elsewhere, also in Europe. Um, we need, we need uh, more qualified um, and high quality teachers. So thank you for, for giving me this opportunity to visit this place. Uh, it was very impressive to, to, to see the children. Um, and um, I wish you the best of luck. Try to expand your activities. Uh, the, the governor was telling me that your dream is to have secondary yes. education here. Yeah. Keep up working for that. Mm -hmm. We have to make dreams come true. That's why we are in politics, right? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, wish you the best of luck and thank you for, for giving me this opportunity to visit this beautiful place. Okay. 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 Okay.